So there it is all finished. Um, I've got it connected to my camera with the tripod ball head. It seems quite stable um, and I've tidied it all up. I've put it all in the enclosure box. I've decided to do away with the speed switches um, as because we're micro stepping to an eighth step the operation of those switches was next to useless um, and besides the, I've managed to get it to such an accurate step that when I've been testing it the difference is the, the error is up to three decimal places and of a second so it is, it is very very accurate with this stepper motor um, so let's go ahead and give that a test I've also just put a piece of white sticker on that gear there just so as when I'm not connected to HDMI, when I'm actually out in the field using it, I can time it with a timer on my phone to make sure that it's still rotating at one rev per minute. So I'm just going to run the program now. So it's Python Stepper. Okay, and it's going to start. So you can just make out that's rotating at one revolution per minute. And <clears throat> I've got the program so as it will tell me um, the exact time that it took to complete one revolution. So I'll come back in a few seconds. Okay, so we're approaching the one revolution mark. Okay, and that's it. And it's just flagged up on screen. And there you go, one complete cycle in one minute. 0 0.07 seconds and I've tested it now for about probably about an hour um, and the difference tends to be between 0 0.3 and 0 0.001 of a second so it's very very stable and very accurate so yeah it seems to be uh, working a treat no problem with my lens I've got the 300mm lens attached, there's quite a bit of weight in that and it's quite stable, it doesn't have any problems. So the next thing now we just wait for a clear night and get it, see what results we get.